Now, over 10 Francophone schools from in and around Canberra have observed a French National Day as an event held at Bishop Cyprian Chihanjiri Secondary School, Luzida. Setholders who attended the event, however, appealed to the government to consider making French compulsory since Congo has joined the East African community. Over 10 Francophone schools this weekend gathered at Bishop Cyprian Kahingire Secondary School to mark French Day celebrations. The event was characterized by French cultural presentations where different schools recited poems, songs and performed dances in French. Bonjour, je m'appelle Nakauchi Juliet. What I think about French, because when I grow up, my parents are planning to take me to France. I finish my studies there. That day, uh, it is a, a French open day. Basically, it's about happiness, mixing with other people who speak French from different schools. As you see here, we are the junior, primary, and here they are secondary. So when they meet them, they get inspired. Makerere University Business School Don Doc, Dr. Mibuga Aseru officiated the event and said observing the event was important for the upcoming French-speaking students and those acquitted with the language. Usually in the, in the year, every March, we celebrate the Francophonie. The Francophonie simply means bringing people of different diverse languages, cultures together and being united by the French language. So to, we are celebrating it in June because we couldn't make it in March. So it is being celebrated by the Association of Teachers of French in Uganda in their different regions. So this is one of the regions. And um, their theme is French, a language of development. French is good for developing tourism. French is good for education. You saw a poem about education. French is good for doing research. It is good for advanced studies. Bell, Shilungu, please. Uh, you Susan and love uh, St. Peter's SS in Zambia. Um, ma présentation de une un, un speech, speech en parlant de la langue française en une langue de développement. C'est ce qu'on a parlé. Um, C'est à propos de la raison pour laquelle on étudie la langue française. Some of the students at the event could not hide their excitement in embracing French language based on the unlimited opportunities they expect from French language. I'm enjoying the performance and I like that they are, prof they are promoting French language because I'm a big fan of, of French actually. I just have this natural love of French. I really love the French language and at school there is this international French course that I take because I really love French and I hope that in future it can take me somewhere. Like I really want to go study abroad and work abroad and get to know other people. J'aime beaucoup le français. Je veux visiter la France un jour et travailler en France. Oui, j'aime beaucoup le français. I'd like to encourage students out there who are looking at French as just a minor language to pass exams. There are very big opportunities you can get when you offer French. There are very, very big opportunities. You do not only become a teacher, but you can become any profession that you want as long as you have French in the background. Senior French teacher Katende Abel appeals to the government to support the teaching of French language to position young people to access opportunities in East Africa community that is now partly Francophone oriented. We are here today to celebrate uh, the French Open Day where our students, students from the various schools in Kampala A, have uh, gathered here to make presentations, to speak to enjoy uh, the French language. This is what we are here for. Uh, it, it, it encourages them, it, make, you know, it encourages them to meet and, um, and, and enjoy speaking French. And it gives them courage. Those ones who are giving up, when they see others talking and speaking, they also get the energy and the courage to continue speaking French. Well, there you have it, celebrating the French.